Spirit is in, Jesus will be glorified. People will be glorifying Jesus or declaring Jesus in their life. So we thank the, the Lord for the Holy Spirit again moving tonight. I could have, I, I wrote down in my note to, to speak on Joshua leadership. But one hour ago, I prepared this lesson for us to go back to the condition of the Holy Spirit to come to us. Na na raki kanda u domo na na yalo tambu membasi gabi kenda. Se the condition that we need to leave for the Holy Spirit to arrive to come. And I believe that's why it's very very important for us to understand how can the Holy Spirit come to us. No, Holy Spirit has been sent to us. But this is what happened in Acts chapter one. And Acts chapter 2, for the Holy Spirit to descend and come into contact with the 120 followers of Jesus Christ uh, in the upper room in the city of Jerusalem. So we are blessed, my friend, that we will talk about the condition of the Holy Spirit to arrive tonight. But before that, once again, I just want to go back to what Randini Gasilebu was sharing in our administration few things I want to point out. When we talk about the blueprint, God already knew about the 20 limitation. God already knew. Two years in 2016, 2017, and 2018, we've been talking about the blueprint. We've been talking about the worship center. To start the worship center, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So when the limitation come, the government approved 20. Hallelujah. And that's why in the beginning of the COVID-19, we start with the worship center, that we can continue with the worship center of 20. Those who are above 20, they can have the worship center. So the blueprint, now you can, you can see today and witness what the Holy Spirit placed in the leaders of this ministry about the 20. Not only that, we were talking about one worship center to have one small maki, sorry, one small tent. And one zone to have one medium tent or a maki for that matter. Now, when we talk about the lifting of the restriction from the 26th, hallelujah, from the 26th, that is this Friday, the government allow the church to start in the worship center or wherever, as long as we hundred or less. Who knew this time? The Holy Spirit already been through our tomorrow. We've been encouraging for people to have their screen, the uh, whiteboard, uh, television set, uh, the uh, overhead projectors sound system, all these things we're talking about that it's happening right now. The government, it's a rule and the regulation now that we can come together 100. Now, talking about the carrier stand, we have two markets, uh, that is 350 and 350. And then another two markets on the side, 350, 350. And normally we supply about 2,000 chairs. We, can do th we cannot do that when they lift the restriction this Sunday. Now, it goes back to the marquee. It goes back to the tent of every zone. Now, if a zone say five worship center, so they should have five small tent and one medium tent. Hallelujah. You know, sometimes when we are not careful, we will be very physical in our walking with God. And when the leaders of the ministry are speaking to us, because we are physical or carnal, we don't really believe that this is the work of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. No, the Holy Spirit already know. Like the Mission Sunday that uh, happen, you will do it as a, as a zone. And we've been pushing from 2000, uh, uh, 2019, 2018,
that one zone should be at least reach 100 members. Where is this 100 members come from? God already knew that. Hallelujah. And sometimes when we share to the church, especially the leaders like this in Ratu School and Memorial School, hallelujah. And I know, I believe, the Holy Spirit will, will, will show it to me. Even some Tal Talgasi, they don't believe. See, well, yeah, a lot of Tal Talgasi, they don't believe that what we share is from the Holy Spirit. Because we know our relationship with the Holy Spirit. And it's very clear in speaking to us. The running of the church, we rely on the Holy Spirit. How can we get this, this television station? The Holy Spirit already plays. On uh, the, uh, this week, Kaltal uh, Gasimbuli going to Namukelau, and we bought one wireless set. The wireless set taken to Namukelau with a disc that they can be live from Namukelau. So this weekend, when we start with our healing service, they will be live from Namukelau. Why? Because we already told uh, the church in Namukelau in 2018, the time will come, the Monday like this training will be live in Namuka. Hallelujah. We'll be live from there. As it's live around BT11, through Facebook, the time will come, we'll be live in Namukelau. We'll be live in Votoa. We'll be live in Ono. See, a lot of us, we don't believe that the Holy Spirit move in the church administration. Uh, sometimes we just focusing on just listening to the Bible study, but we don't want to take the, the Bible study, the word of the Lord, practically and put it into our day-to-day -day operation. So now, when it's uplifted, say for this Sunday, when we will live from the carrier stand or we will live on the healing Sunday from the foreshore, or if we live from uh, um, Zaire Church in the Mukelau from 8 o'clock and then the healing Sunday, hallelujah, how many zones that you will have a screen and you will have a big screen there from your computer, whether you pull from the Facebook, hallelujah, and throw it on the screen. If we've been listening to the Holy Spirit from our leaders, no, you'll be excited to see, to sit as a zone, and you watch on the big screen the life from Foshoa, or the life from the Kyrgyzstan, or the life from Jairus Church, depending the approval. Today I spoke with the assistant uh, uh, commissioner of police who looks after the operation. And he said, you can go on uh, uh, carrier stand or wherever you normally do your church as long as the facilities is 100 and less. Hallelujah. So we never know whether we'll go to the carrier stand or we'll go to, uh, uh, to the foreshore for our healing Sunday. This Sunday, the 20, 26th, 27th, 28th, the 28th of June, which is the last Sunday of this month. And if we have been uh, uh, faithful with our, with our blueprint, then the zone from, uh, say, Monikoso, uh, maybe the zone from Makoi, the zone from Narere, you will meet in a, in a hall and there in the big screen, praying in uh, Fosua or praying in uh, uh, the Kerestan, or praying in Jairus Church in the Mukilau, and uh, praying for people that they are also in your altar, in your various areas, whether in Lambasadua, Lambasarua, or Lambasatolu, Sabu Sabu Central, or Sabu Sabu East, or Sabu Sabu West, or maybe those in Nandronga Valley, or Nandronga Singatoka. If you already achieve that you have a laptop to pull in the Facebook, and throw it to the screen. Hallelujah. No more just looking at your small phone. Hallelujah. Only for you and the two other heads looking at a small phone. But now, because we obey the Holy Spirit, I'm just sharing, because the Holy Spirit knew this time, 2020. While we were talking in 2016, 2017, 2018, urging senior pastors, urging Taltala, look for your blueprint. Today, some of us, we haven't achieved those blueprints. Hallelujah. So when Jesus said, go to Jerusalem, to the upper room, and wait for the Holy Spirit, three quarter of the 500, three quarter of the 500, which is 380, 
they go elsewhere. Only 120 went up to the upper room. Some of us that we are watching today, most of the time you are not tuning in. Most of the time you are not logging in. Most of the time you are not uh, waking up early for the Kamba Sinikua or the Katalaumana in the Radio Fijuan. No wonder we are struggling. We are struggling with our food. We are struggling with our family. And we are struggling in, in looking after the church that God ordain you, God call you because of the spirit of disobedience. Hallelujah. I don't know whether it's just a pure disobedience or maybe you don't respect or honor or the, your level of your loyalty to your leadership. Hallelujah. If you don't know, know today that this church is being led by the Holy Spirit. We've been sharing and sharing and sharing. I don't know what other evidence that you need for you to believe that your leaders are led by the Holy Spirit. What other evidence? Hallelujah. What other evidence you, senior pastor, you tell Tala, that you don't believe that your leaders are led by the Holy Spirit? There are senior pastors, they are coming here. I mean, you are really humble after the, the prayers here on Wednesday and Saturday when we go to the executive office. They sit, here, sit there and they pour out you know, what they've been seeing in New Methodist. They are, how they look up to New Methodist. And how God is using New Methodist that never done before. Never done before. Hallelujah. In the church history of Fiji. Praise the Lord. Now this is our mighty man of God. Today before I came up, I met uh, the general superintendent of uh, of the All Nation Christian Fellowship about one hour ago before we came up, me and Rendini. And he was very appreciative of the program and said, as soon as we come together and all the lifting, all the coronavirus, like just disappear. It was good when we were praying in our individual church, but when we come together, hallelujah, who called the church to come together? Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit was looking for someone. Why a new Methodist? That's why I'm asking the leaders during our leaders training this, this evening. What other evidence you need? New Methodist Christian Fellowship. Hallelujah. That God from 2009 at the stadium in Suba placed in my heart the four things that he will do. Number one, peculiar people. Number two, ghostbusters. Number three, God chasers. Number four, history makers. Till today we still are history makers. Hallelujah. I want to challenge our life today. Before I go to the lesson tonight, we need to suck up and believe in our leaders. We believe that the Holy Spirit is using this ministry because how you look at your leader, because he's there in front of you. Hallelujah. Physically, he's there in front of you. If your leader is going to the Wailing Sioux Hall to pray, what about you? What, what are you doing every morning? You, maybe you are praying, but you are not listening to the Kamba Sinikua. Maybe you're listening, but you're listening... Uh, maybe at 8 o'clock or maybe at 9 o'clock. I don't know. But there are some indicators that you should, that you should take it seriously for us to move to another level. See, God, when on January and February and the beginning of March, I was talking on the divine heights of God. I was talking on divine heights. Hallelujah. The divine heights that nobody knew, even myself, I don't know, that the March, the third month of 2020, that God will do something peculiar in the world. Hallelujah. That will close down what men always rely on and send people that they have, have faith in God to their knees. And the churches will come together. And a lot of people in the secular world will, will talk about God wherever they are. But I believe... NCF, NCF was prepared for two to three years. We've been prepared. We've been prepared. We've been prepared. The teaching, 
the molding, the encouragement that has been coming. So I take this time to just to thank the Holy Spirit for preparing us. Number three, number two, sorry, number, number one is a blueprint. Number two, memory joggers. Allow those mem memory joggers to continue to come to, to the MPET, uh, to the media and marketing, because we have allocated every Tuesday, 6 p.m., to be our memory joggers program, 6, uh, 6 to 6.30. So continue to come. Number three, there will be a new program on Wednesday. Every Wednesday, we will have an online combined cell. Online combined cell, which will start at 7 o'clock. So 7 o'clock, be ready. Maybe testimony, maybe prayers, maybe singing in your worship center. Remember, in your worship center. Every worship center. Uh, you can combine if they are if they are close to one another, they can all come together as long as less than 100. Hallelujah. Not this Wednesday, the next Wednesday that we can come together. This Wednesday, you can only listen from home. So you can listen from home on the 24th. But next week, you can go, you can sit together as worship center. We call it online combined cell. Online combined cell starting at 7 o'clock every Wednesday. A prayer for the nation Monday to Saturday, please try to tune in and support our prayer warriors that they come here. Monday right up to Tuesday at 11 to 12. The mission team, they will start their visitation next week. The mission team will start their visitation around the central um, from Tuesday right up to, mon to Monday. Four days in a week that they will start their, uh, their visitation. And uh, tune in and log in, especially those that I, I already shared. That today, leaders training, the Wednesdays, while waiting for your lunch, and the Sundays, the two programs on Sundays. Hallelujah. Those one, I believe, should be compulsory to everyone. Hallelujah. Monday, leaders training for leaders. The Wednesdays, that is for congregation because of the uh, combined online cell. And the while waiting for your lunch, for those that are free on those days, and especially on Saturday, nine, uh, 8 to 9, and also the God of Our Nation program. I also take this time to thank all the senior pastors and all the RCs. Thank you for the updates. Some of us, your update just, hallelujah, really uplifting to us. Very encouraging when you go through what's go going on in your zone. I take this time once again. Randini already mentioned that, the global director already mentioned. I want to mention again, personally, Remember, we are accountable to their spiritual growth, uh, we as a leader today. Those are some of the points that I believe that uh, it's very important. Remember, 26th, that is this Friday. Hallelujah. So let's tell my Lord to work a worship center. I'll encourage the world to worship center. Taltala, Taltala, and Gase, make sure. Hallelujah. On Sunday, make sure to update me along mine. Not what the two work a zone, but and don't what we call the healing Sunday. For those of you uh, outside Suba, you can tune in also send. Hallelujah. No, 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 update. Bit of two update. Lot to worship center. But because of this is a healing Sunday, lock my baka region. Sorry, baka baka zone. So I take this time once again to thank you all. Now, let us go to the lesson. Hallelujah. The conditions of the Holy Spirit to come. Number one, when we are in the plan of God, everything about God and His power, His revelation, His miracle, His provision, His blessing will come to us. The Bible says, I alone knows the plan I have for you, the plan to prosper you. Regardless of the situation that we're going through, as long as we are in the plan of God. Hallelujah. When we do the plan of God, I tell you, my friend, the Holy Spirit will be attracted to our life. Will be attracted to our life. Why? 
because we are in the plan of God. The plan of God for them to go back to the Jerusalem. Even though the risk of being attacked either by Roman soldiers or the temple guards, the Pharisees and the teachers of the law, they were very vulnerable to be attacked or arrested. But the Holy Spirit, because it's a plan of God, hallelujah, because it's a plan of God, they have to do it. And I believe that's why the Holy Spirit came. When you are in the plan of God, you can be doing something, maybe it looks right, hallelujah, maybe something that looks good, maybe that brings money to you, maybe a promotion to you, but is that in the plan of God or not? Hallelujah. You know, sometimes when we are blessed physically, when we are blessed, so-called, in this circular uh, promotion, be careful. Ask God through the Holy Spirit, is this the plan of God? We heard the testimony of Taltalaga Siswa. The plan of God is to go and get his parents. That one week of Holy Spirit conference, only God was preparing them because few weeks down the line, his father will be called home. Hallelujah. Imagine if they don't have that one week together, the closeness, the sharing. Hallelujah. Only God knows that. See, when you are in the plan of God, it will attract the Holy Spirit to work in your life. And I want to challenge our life today. You know, some of us, we, we do a lot of sacrifice. We do a lot of things. But we are not in the plan of God. How can you know that you are in the plan of God? Listen to the Holy Spirit. And listen to your leaders. That they are spirit filled. Hallelujah. You know, most of the time we listen to, to the leaders of the secular world. But they are not spirit filled. But we, we give our loyalty. We give our everything. We give our time. We give our best. What about the people that they are spirit-filled? Hallelujah. How much more that we need to follow their instruction and obey what they are saying to us? Remember, the Bible says, hallelujah, that obedience is better than sacrifice. And I want to, to challenge leaders of New Methodists that you are listening today or any other church leaders that you are listening today. When you obey the word of the Holy Spirit or the Holy Spirit will use your leaders to speak to you, I tell you, that's what pleases God. God pleases because of the obedience, not of the sacrifice. Salevuna lotu, salevuna pagata buisoro. Yeketu na talin rene. Oh, hallelujah. Just bring a frustration and tiredness. We are tired of worshiping God because we are not obeying God. We are doing something that we think that is right. No, God does not operate on what we think. God operates on what He says. God operates on His word. The the standard of worshiping God is his word. Hallelujah. The church to grow, the church to explode, the church to become different and become a church of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. For that matter, apostol in your this is what you can do. Hallelujah. You have to go to your login mind. Login mind. You have to go to your bar wrong. Bar wrong. You have to go to your bar wrong. You have to go to your bar wrong. You have to go to your bar wrong. But in the moment, you have to go to your sacrifice. You have to go to your bar wrong. 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 Hallelujah. You have to go to your bar wrong. Hallelujah. So you can't get any, any bounce. Let's le show my level and don't do not me bounce making. You give your tithe. You give here and you operate there and you run here and you sacrifice there. But God is waiting for your obedience to His plan and His purpose. Can you can For us to do exactly as Jesus said. Jesus said to the disciple. In Acts chapter 1, verse 8 and 9, 
you go and wait. Hallelujah. In the city. For the Holy Spirit will come. Then you shall receive power. You will not receive power unless the Holy Spirit come. You will never receive the Holy Spirit until you go and wait. You will never go and wait until you listen to the instruction. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. A few nights ago, we talked at home and we were just sharing with our grand, grandchildren. Hallelujah. That it is not easy to walk with God. There will be a lot of mountains. There will be a lot of valleys. There will be a lot of weather and storms that will come your way. It just stay focusing to the word of God. The word of God will never change. What God said, you stand in there. Other things will come, but don't focus on the mountain. Don't focus on the valley. Don't focus on the stormy waters of ra or rough sea. You focus on the word of God because all these things will come and go, but the word of God remains forever. Isaiah 40 verse 8, one of my famous Bible verses. The Bible says that plants die and flowers wither, but the word of our Lord remains forever. Woo, hallelujah. So Jesus said, go into the upper room. Wait there. I believe the Holy Spirit come. And a second delay and a second when you listen, how can I listen? There are people in front of me. Yeah. See, when Jesus was taken up, then they have to listen to Peter and John. But you have to listen to somebody, especially to your leader. And if you can't listen to your leader, then who are you listening to? You cannot say you listen to the Holy Spirit when the Holy Spirit telling your leader something and you are listening to another Holy, to the, another Holy Spirit. There, there, there cannot be two Holy Spirit. There is only one Holy Spirit. Can't be Holy Spirit. It has to be a different spirit. Because if you listen to the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit will tell you, go to your leader, listen to your leader, attach to your leader. What is your leader saying about the church? You are not the leader. You are listening to your leader. I'm calling your leader to lead you. So you cannot lead because any two heads is a beast. Hallelujah. Sarimbibi, ya namuna, kenda tarati kumaikina na kanasa. Na lesson ini loyalty, 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 loyalty. What is loyalty? Listen to your leader. Listen to your leader. Listen to your leader. Respect your leader. Make your leader happy. Because your leader will listen to the Holy Spirit. Because the church belongs to him. And the sinner do make a little canon and a lot of chisu. But he can do it. We always have a different style of leadership. We always have a different in solving a problem. So we cannot be all leaders. There must be someone that teaches us and guides us and leads us. So we have only one leader. Hallelujah. And when we listen to that leader, when we listen to that commander, when we listen to that platoon commander, when we listen to that company commander, when we listen to the ship captain, when we listen to the pilot in command, then it will be a smooth sailing for boat. It, it will be a smooth flying for airplane. It will be a smooth leadership in a village. What about in the church? Then the church will be very powerful because of one voice. Hallelujah. Except the secret of church growth. I believe I've been teaching and teaching and teaching 
Sometimes senior pastors when they call me na dapat metori na zon ko, dapat metori zon ko. Wagabuli na ngaver na secret of church growth. A lot of church are struggling, a lot of worship center are struggling, a lot of zone are struggling why? Because you think otherwise from your leader. You think otherwise. Girl, as long as you under NCF, as long as you under New Methodist Christian Fellowship, which is also known as Soul Sudicious Ministry. Hallelujah. You need to be abide by the leadership and the instruction that the leader is trying to tell us. Oh, wakasamataka manda mendo na mati balu. Hallelujah. Mendreo oh komandongo, mendreo komandongo, CEO ni ni A company, mendreo CEO ni C company, artu tanreke tanreke. Sandua na mati balu ya kusura sura. Sandua na mati balu malu malu mu. Sandua na mati balu lebu kina na dega kena backstabbing. Gossip and slandering. Why? Because there is no respect to the leadership. No respect to those in authority. Hallelujah. Bring it home. Bring it to the church of Jesus Christ. For us to face the challenge that is out there. For us to arrive at the height. The divine height. The divine height that God prepared for us. Then we need to come together. Humble ourselves. Hallelujah. And uh, it was very uh, eye opening. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Aku sen, dah buat nau tu na, lalu tu esel lebih tinggi rotu main na, tambah tambah mana maka, aku dah reda tak itu na, baru ni nanti buat nau, saya rombot TV itu, buru buru, na, sokong sokong lalu tebel itu lagi na, and you know things happen and it happened, but when he was sharing, Hallelujah, sokong sokong lalu tici su Kristu ayang, anda begini na, tambah tak kawor, anda begini na, tambah tak humble lagi kau, Hallelujah, when God spoke to Solomon and said to Solomon, Solomon, my people who are called by my name. The perimeter is the people are called by my name. They must humble themselves. Oh. Ningono kwa kau no mutiki no kusini na kama tuko kina kai tuko niani no mutiko esata leader standing today. Gori saranga na kusanga mbaga ni kama i. Gori saranga na yalo ni rebellious spirit. You are not telling us. You are not talking to us. You are not writing to us to, to, to say. But your accent speaks louder than your words. Yana vuna kwenda undenre kina metoso na na lotu ichisu ni tiko kina na na yalo ni dui ndui. Kina yalo ni anumi kwa bakata kikwaya. Kina yalo ni dui nrenga na nona. Dui kautanga na nona mua. Amen. So we must listen to the word of Jesus. Do lako. Atuku ni ngana lako? Lako. Hallelujah. And the same Holy Spirit, kurtuliwara kurtu opita patakichoni, same Holy Spirit that we are sharing today. Because from that very lesson. Now, those people, they don't go through that lesson. We can go through the, that lesson because it's, uh, it's written down by Apostle John and also in, uh, in Acts chapter 1 and 2 by Dr. Luke. So it's in our face now. It's right here that we are sharing this lesson here. For the Holy Spirit to be attracted to anyone. For the Holy Spirit to be attracted to the zone. For the Holy Spirit to be attracted to the worship center. Medaka saranga na kaitu nini medaka. Ke adaka ngona blueprint. Oh, ba adangi dangi. Na bi zone tau dhoko ibiti. 110, 107. Ke mal sa adua ngana screen lebu. Mal ni adaka ma ina kando don me adaka. Mal te lebu baka titinga. Lebu e... Retu, Retu Sara, lebu baka motoriki, lebu mila uluna, lebu sini baka mbauta, lebu na ibuka buke daka. Sega mbeka ni kero rida, na helo tambu e baka takila tumai. We are not quick to do what we are told to do. We are taking time. Why we are taking time? Because we don't believe. We don't believe what our leaders is saying that is from God. Well, we don't believe that what our leader is saying, that uh, there, there is some essence, there is some elements, there is some goodness in that. 
Twenty the numbers. Fifteen the number of worships at the Ronstadt. We did not pull that number from the sky. No. Holy Spirit place in our heart. Now zone carry me hundred. We don't pull that from, from, the, from the air. No. God already placed because the time Dona Bosa, the Buddha took a hundred ball prime minister to look at. Get to know the new norm. Get to know the new norm. Then do us on a new norm go. Then do a whole 2020, there are about two more. 20, 100, 100. Then do a 150, 100, 200. Or the Ekla, Sidi Ekla. And the Tambunga Sat. When we are going with the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit will tell us what to do. Nisatukuni Atribango, do Bukaroma in a Sinu. Do Bukaroma in a Kasi, Kembal, the Tolubuni, Lotuna, Sikatambu. Hallelujah. Kembal, the Hello Tambu Satukuni Utimai. A Satukuni Utimai in a Zakabaya and a Lutu. A Satukuni Utimai. Sar can the Lelebuna care as that we are to. And Leleb were a puny tal and a Lebuni don't the Lim. Sar can see them in a Bulangi, can talk a Cogotal Tomai Valley. Sang of someone in Rotong Hannibal. Sang a Sindon of our Rotomai Valley, Gori, a Buddhist Sagori, the Buddhist Sagori. Buddha sana baka ulumbale. Loku yara. Lead the malu malumu. Hallelujah. When we lead, wa adama na kena sinai. O di mengi control te kira. Gora salako tumengo. Sang sa sinai nga usama di lakon ngaibale. Hallelujah. Dua nga biko liku me rape. Dua biko na high hill. Praise the Lord. Ulumbale. Ulumbale loki loki kena nga. I want to challenge our life today. Hallelujah. No tell go. Faith in God's unthinkable plan. Go on an unthinkable plan. And do not tell us that we need to go to new methods. We need to go. We are supposed to go to a new television. Oh, do you remember that we were wrong to my mirror? To my new coin, a killing coin. We are supposed to go to a new one. We are not going to go to the new one. Hallelujah. 2016, we are going to go. We are going to go. Later, we are going to go to a new one. We are going to go to a new one. Hallelujah. We are going to go to a television station. Niko sa tuki batal tu me Australia. Hallelujah. Malta daba ni abosu tago ko ya. Endu na ka na yalo tambu ka ka. Rongo da. Lebu na ngona. You need to know this. You need church leaders. You need to know this. When the Holy Spirit plays something for us to share, garau na de ko abosu tago so malta endu ni bolbo da ngoe eseka ni boko di rawa. Numo abosu tago na daga daga ni yalo tambu. Kesa kaya na yalo tambu ngo. Maki, mina ngarami kina. Ure na baba koso. Na, ndame ndame. Ali musamu na ndame ndame. Na kake de atuko ni tumai. For two, three years ago. Yeke baka nda bosu taka tiko. Nanga struggle tiko. Halalonga sosa. Halalonga sosa tiko itumba. Hallelujah. Amen. So, halalonga itumba. Bera gani halalonga itumba. Toyo musamu na ndame ministries. Hallelujah. O koya nga wa tine kere tunangone. Metho mutu meni kwa. Ure meka nga. E sombe kare dobi ya baba muri muri ke. O, start mai maloai. O kitu nga kitu leono, kitu start mewe maluai. Iyo, kitu start balte bina katana. Yalo tambu me kitu start. Ya nabuna kitu ya zamukina undo lu nikuwa. Kutu na zaba tale morongo adha, a zaba tale moreitha. Munga ibuka ndine ndine taka gina ni yalo tambu bilu taka tiko nila olongo. What else to see? What else to hear? What else to experience? Na lebu ni tala indendre. Ena lotu itisu. Kabina kata huko amina. Na tiko tala nendo na level. We supposed to be another level. Right now. It depends on our maturity. It depends on how humble that we can come and take the word of God, the word of Jesus, exactly what Jesus is telling us. Totally. Number four, the diligent in prayers. Hallelujah. Lebu nangon nanda do makutu na masu se basi kana masu ngon ngai tiga bukina balenga asate na na kena balamu kana masu na kena na kena langa tiga mai na bulu ni masu. Hallelujah. Na nonda lako pati kina masu. Diligent in prayer. Diligent in prayer. Na diligent go na mama kutu. Diligent. Ana kaya kabi kina voltamu. Na lako pito pati kichoni. Au kila tingo rin na screen. Na tikini voltamu. Ana zaka zaka na kena wase. Dua. Mena tini karua tini katulu. Then they return to Jerusalem from the Mount of Olives. Which is near Jerusalem. The Sabbath day's journey. Kema li duwa kana sika na lako. And when they had entered. They went up into the upper room. Where they were staying, Peter, James, John, Andrew, Philip, and Thomas, Bartholomew, and Matthew, James, the son of Ephesus, and Simon the Silas, and Judas, the son of James. 
Hallelujah. Lango tsukai masu. Na kalo e na vaga vaga ni kondo maku tu na masu. Se na ngangandre mai nalo tambu ni rede ni kondo masu. Hallelujah. Marta na masu barita kana mu kaboro. Na masu barita kana mu tale ra ra. Na masu barita ka. Iku sini barra biti ko na no mukoko. Si. I believe one purpose of prayer is to to show to to show us that we are humble enough. That's why we pray. Niko sekani do masu iku ya katiko. Why should I pray? I have the strength, I have the wisdom, I have the knowledge, I have everything, I have my car, I have a beautiful house. Why should I pray? Masunga kura tamata na mrabua, masunga kura tamata sinroka, masunga kura bango, masunga kura baya. No, everybody needs to pray. Kesa masu chisu alumi ni kalo, kesa masu chisu oko enda mitu kona tiko tiko mai lo malangi. He came and pray and pray, pray in the morning. Pray in the evening. Pray in the afternoon. Sindu na ngone. Hala nikile na masu. Hallelujah. Diligent in prayer. When you are diligent in prayer, this thing attacks. Nana wuna. Kewa ndana nital talangasi. Au kiri kendo tiko menda. Lako teni me nonta vale. Comfort. Ndali masu. Mbata ngoa na kaya nreta na yalo tambu. Ndendu kwa sa ngarami kalu tunga na mo experience. Sianga ngarami kalu na kuko ni yalo tambu. Kwa na rindiki nendo tani. Whatever you share. Wherever you go, it will be different. It will be very different. Why? Because prayer is a sign of humbleness. Prayer is a sign of weak. You go, we are kind to go, I am weak. I need God. And God will make you weak to be strong. Totally. Number five, persevere. Perseverance is continue to do it. Continue, 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 continue. Hallelujah. When you continue to do it, you are not looking at the result. You are not focusing on the result. You are focusing on what is said to you. Clearly, when you go, can you take a look at the sawara katonga na kene sao? Hallelujah. That's a good one. Can you make lo tunga sawara katonga na kene blessing? Sawara katonga na open doors. Siyanga. That is that is duty. That's God's duty. The reason why we come and worship God is because we, we just love Him. The reason why I, I, I'm standing here is just because I love Him. The reason why I go to the Wailing Seawall sea every morning is just because I love Him. If you can remember most of my preaching 10 years ago, 15 years ago, I was in the Millennium in Taltala and I was in the Millennium in Taltala and I was in the Millennium in Taltala and I was in the Millennium in Taltala. Maybe I need the Holy Spirit to give me the word that I can boldly speak. I don't attend any Bible school. I don't attend any seminary. No. It's just my love for God. I'll be one of those at the back or right at the back. But if we parade because of our love for God, I can put up my hands. I am one of those Taltala that I can be standing on the front row. Because I love my God. I love my God. And your love for God will be seen by your action. Hallelujah. You see my action. You see me running around here like a crazy person from a business house to another business house trying to open. I want them to enjoy what I'm enjoying. Every time there's some new program, I have to be the one there. To get the crowd, people come in and pass it on to the senior pastors. So ni tal tal, saya bagi cini, bagi lu semua boleh ramas tu nggak? Saya waktu ni masuk ni tal, ni ribu kubu kita tal. So when you are in this in this ministry, remember, Hallelujah, remember the way that we lead, the way that we share the platform. Satu kau nontonah, na buka buka ni ngasih lembu ni Anglican Church, na singkat tu mesti masuk ina. Sa bosa vira na, otu na bosa vira na lutu chachi, vira na egil ka nivitsi. Sa kai, baka pini pina kataka tiko kai na platform go. Tuno ka sa, baka pini pina kataka na egil ka church in Fiji. For the platform that is given to them to come and pray. Remember, kia andu tale no na na television station go. Hallelujah. Number six, the power of unity. I want to challenge our life today. Hallelujah. Power of unity. They were in one accord. 
e alo bata sema na alo o sabo se tigo ngoba galebo na sema ni alo ke ko sa sema ke ko sa sema ni sema mandanga mai ne bola mata ke ko sa sema ni sema mai na nero teaching nga i sema ba gaba gina lo ikera go sin lorai ke ko sa sema ni sema roma i gina kai tukuni tsuga ni moza kaba ke ko sa sema ni sema roma na katala umana ke ko sa sema ni sema roma na kamba sinikwa ko nga i sema ba gaba gina lo ikera it's something for you to do your homework Hallelujah. Go ni mataka na badi sine sara na varong na kambasi. Kambasi ni kwa. Ni badi lako sobu tinga, badi lutu sobu, lutu sobu, lutu sobu. Moni tinga, tutel tithake. Hallelujah. Try to be genuine with your worshiping God. Tumo tole mando mato mato andina. Kaku ni go remind the gitigo. Tala kenda ni tal tal gas, kenda ni tal tal. Kaku ni da remind the gitigo na kame tava kawa. Kawa na kaya dudu mwada kawa. You go remind the gitigo, but you go sin baron chuna elotabu. You so you have to be reminded. If you listen to the Holy Spirit, and the Holy Spirit is placing the things that we are sharing, then you rely on that Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit will remind you. Na no matiko indu na na go na remind that. Will remind you of what the church is telling you to do to be part of the church, because you are leaders of the church. You go ngui na na matiko. You go tana wa ya. You go. Skip the gatigo, but the lava. You will see my wrong to get out of Hallelujah. Power of unity, Acts chapter 2, verse 1 and 2. The Bible says, When the days of Pentecost had fully come, they were all in one accord. The Bible says, They were all in one accord. All in one accord. They were all in one accord. Every, every 120 were were knitted together in their heart. When I'm speaking from the studio here in Turek, are you with me? Are you with the leadership? Are you with NCF? Are you part of Souls to Jesus? I want to challenge our life today. Nanumatiko, ngay singa moni ti mado mingo, 29th of June, sa kakambura kita lani ratskuna. Hallelujah. And the last one tonight, for me to end our Exactly 8 o'clock. See, the Holy Spirit told me to check my time. Exactly 8 o'clock. Hallelujah. I told Randini, you will take from, from uh, uh, 6 to 7, and I will take it from 7 to 8. Hallelujah. Holy Spirit, to you are going to be a long time. You are going to be 8 o'clock. Sharp. You are going to be a long time. 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 You that your leaders in this church are led by the Holy Spirit. And we, when we are led by the Holy Spirit, we have a lot to achieve together. And the blessings that we will face will right across Taltalangase, Matabubale, Taltala, Matabubale, young people, the youth, families, Ngasin Lotu. Why? Because we are under one accord. And number seven, we are in one place. Even though that we are different, but we are one place right now. Right now we are in one place because we are listening to the same thing. Geographically, we are in different place. But right now, we are together. And I want to challenge your life today. Hallelujah. And I come in the corner of the the Kerewana Kelowna, 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 and I take this time once again to thank the Holy Spirit for the message tonight. I take this time to thank the Holy Spirit for the atmosphere that is coming to Banuelebu, that is coming to Sabu Sabu, and uh, to the region of Mathuata and Bua, and the region of Sabu Sabu, and the region of uh, Tabeuni, and Gamea. For those that are listening from Kadabu and those that are in the western side, I take this time to ask you, please, let us come together. Let us come together. Let us believe together that God will bless us tonight. Hallelujah. 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 Let us worship him. Let us worship him together. Hallelujah. 
Chopo na ni mami kalo, ke mami paka bini na kan sika bini na kan ikua, bina apa kalau turang kan muni zaka zaka mana zaka zaka itu, aku sapa kan bini na kan bikin muni chopo na nunggu kalo ni sika bini na kan ikua, bina apa kalau muni hello ni dua mata, bina apa kalau muni hello ni paka rongo, bina apa kalau turang kan hello ni zaka zaka mata, sapa kan bini na kan bikin muni chopo na nunggu kalo, hello sika bini na kan ikua, nunggu muni zaka zaka mana, nunggu muni zaka zaka itu, ninggal sereka, kena lama ni, sungguh sungguh lalu. Virna bilu taki, virna tal tal gase, virna rendini. Na boleh bercuma dan enggak betul. Na boleh berturangan sisu. Kamu ni dah biasa tapi, kita bagai tukar nello kubu kubu, nello za, nello sisu ya, nello butu butu. Aku sah sabu raka, tal raka, cancel takkan ada sisu. Aku sah serikan nello binaka, aku sah serikan nello di dua bata, aku sah serikan di sini binaka di kuar. Aku sah masulaka. So itu bi mati, so itu rumah tu nak malu malu ni anggo, so orang tak boleh limbula, so orang tak boleh bale, aku sah tak boleh kata la raka cancel tak kena bawa, itu kalau top mati, spirit of infamity, I bind you right now and cancel it in the mighty name of Jesus, right here, right now, in Jesus name. We thank you, Father God. We thank you. We glorify your name. We praise your mighty name. Hallelujah. Kurang usah masuk lagi, sorry, lengan tu bagai labu, sorry, tengok mana tak tak. Oh, ramah kan sangat ratu nak kena kena main, ramah orang tu main ikut. Sangat banyak nilai yang dilo tu. Kerana tu tali takkan sih yang moni tiba tiba. Father, they always look forward to the Monday teaching like this. I bind every spirit of lack and poverty, wrong spirit that are coming in their home. I pray in the name of Jesus, cast them out to the lake of fire. Father, I release the spirit of abundance. The provision, the open doors, and the blessings into their life. We thank you, Father God, tonight. We thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Every sickness in our body, every sickness in our heart. Hallelujah. We pray. Hallelujah. Oh, your mighty hands will move, restore, lead us in our tomorrow. We thank you, Father God. The open doors and opportunity. Thank you, Father God, for the promotion in the workplace. Thank you, Father God, the open doors for some people to go back to work. Thank you, Father God, for the open doors for new souls, new worship centers, new friendship, new fellowship that only you can approve, only you can allow in our life. We thank you. We praise your mighty name. Hallelujah. We thank you, Jesus. Oh, bina apa lembut tu mangut, si bina di kuah. Bina apa lembut nama ni bisa tapi, bina apa lembut turang nama ni tak kata kemana. Bina apa lembut turang nama ni dorong masuk. Soal nanti kuni kuar, stop tu nanti nanti. Lembut mereka nabi bala mai bale. A lot of domestic disagreement, a lot of domestic arguments. I bind all those spirit Lord. Turang ni, aku serahkan al ni bising gomi, aku serahkan al ni. Be more shorty. You know how I live with Turanga. You come on in a zaga zaga man and a bima tabu bal and a sing bina gadi ko. So we can say biwe. Er nagi nagi mer biwe mu mer lako. So we can nagi nagi mer sana. So we can tuni lotu mer sana tungai bal. Na lebu ni bima na lebu ni bima la. Lebu na kaya tu tungai bal. So maso so zabura katala raka. How can salta kan evet sisu? Hello zala, hello dui dui, hello kubu kubu, hello duga dukali. Russia na evet sisu. Na boleh buat mangun esok bina kadi kuat. We thank you. Na boleh buat turanga. Maka thank you untuk natalan esok bina kadi kuat. Father, thank you for the peace that you will send tonight. Berto tu kau mai tele bu north, tele bu south. Berto mai no sorry, berto mai sawani. Na abu way ni buka. Na boleh buat tu mai obalau, tu mai binti way, tu mai kandabu. Na no ngam barabi. Nan rongah singa toka, nan rongah beli, nan rinci mai nandi, nan rinci mai nawaka. Oh, mai bunda, lau toka, nan tambua, mai ba, ra, every region, oh lord, mai New Zealand, mai Brisbane, mai Serene, mai Griffith, nan boleh mai, nan boleh boleh buko, UK. They listening today, oh may, maybe they listen later tonight. I thank you, Father God. That you will visit every home 
every leaders, every couple. Thank you, Father God, for the understanding that you'll place in their life. The clarity of being a leader that you'll place in their heart. Hallelujah. Thank you for the government of the day. Everything that we'll request will be approved for us to worship. Hallelujah. We thank you for the lifting of the restriction. We thank you for the hundreds. We thank you, Father God, that you will place in the leaders of the church, especially NCF, as we'll be meeting tomorrow, the wisdom, the knowledge, how to go about, how to do it in a very practical, very effective way. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Father, for all the prayers that are uttered tonight. We give you the glory and the honor and the praises to be yours and yours alone. In Jesus' wonderful name we pray. And everybody say, Amen and Amen. Authority will be on Gomu Ba. We never got a gun on the bullet. We never live in a Samomai. Take this time. We never got to get to the Matovale. Kusakaoti. Memory joggers. Lakotungamai. On a Matovale. Bobby Watini. Not to Mula no one. Open Tico. Hallelujah. The Namakatanama in a Tuesday is every 6 p.m. Hallelujah. To my bit about Ortona. Media marketing division. Hallelujah. We sing a two city care and on the clock and a cabby. Next week, hallelujah. We'll be different. We'll be from Ratuskuna as usual. Hallelujah. Every Monday, starting at the uh, same time, 6 o'clock. So until next week at Ratuskuna Memorial School, I say and thank the team here at the My TV for hosting us for about three months now. We give him the glory, the honor, and the praises to be his and his alone. Ruatolu, Holy Spirit, we thank you in Jesus' name. Jesus is Lord. To God be the glory forever and ever. Amen. Have a wonderful evening in Jesus' name.